Hi friends, weird way to start the vlog, but I thought it was an entertaining way. Um, I got uh, the new collab between Bella Beauty Bar and M. Jones, and it's very cute. Looks like that. Um, well, I was just busy filming swatches for it, and you need to see what Kanade did. Not only did she take over my fabric that I was swatching on top of, she bumped her tail in the swatches. So now she has a rainbow tail. What do you have to say for yourself? You're just very pleased with yourself, aren't you, that you found a new bed? <laughs> oh my goodness, the cats are wild. <laughs> but today's a really exciting day. Today is, of course, the reveal for my collab with Stroud, and I'm so excited. It is going up in three hours. I can't wait for everyone to see it. I'm so excited to spill the beans. Of course, a lot of you already knew what the down low was because I was trying to give you some hints, but I didn't want to like say it right away. <laughs> I'm just so excited and pumped. I have a wax appointment in about 30 minutes, so I'm gonna leave for that soon. And I'm actually gonna film another look with my palette today, I'm trying to get a lot of content ready for you, which of course that'll already be up by the time this vlog goes up. Uh, but today's just such a good day. I'm so excited. We're gonna go get dinner with Zane's parents tonight to celebrate and I, Oh, I'm just so excited. So yeah, let's get started. Oh my goodness, 30 minutes until the reveal. I just got done filming this little look with my palette. That'll be already up on Instagram and TikTok. I mentioned that earlier. I'll go stand in the light so you can actually see it. Super cute, just shifty green magical wing. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to probably just work on editing the little Instagram videos I just filmed. And I'm just going to sit anxiously waiting for the reveal to happen. I'm home alone today, Zane's at work, so it's just me and the cats. Leela's over there on the couch. Let's go say hi to her. Leela, darling. Yeah, are you so excited? You're such a darling little angel. Ah! <laughs> It's in one minute, oh my gosh. I'm like shaking, ah, I'm freaking out. My YouTube video is like scheduled to go right at noon, my time obviously. Um, and I have my draft for the first post on Instagram. Ah, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I am just waiting for it to turn 12 o'clock. My heart is racing right now. <laughs> Absol, come be with me, I'm all alone. Oh goodness, oh goodness, oh goodness, oh goodness. I even have my palette next to me for moral support. <laughs> oh, this is so exciting. I feel like this is the longest minute ever. It's still not noon. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be any second now. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. <gasps> it's noon, share. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. <laughs> ah! I'm already responding to Shroud's post. I'm freaking out, I can't believe it. Oh my gosh, let me make sure it actually posted to YouTube. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's on YouTube. It's out there. The reveal is out there. Shroud's post is up. Chloe and I are just texting back and forth, basically screaming at each other. Oh my gosh. It's so cool. I'm just sitting here reading Shroud's post because I didn't even read it yet. I just commented and liked it without even reading it. My heart is racing. I'm freaking out. Okay, I already got I already got messages. Oh my gosh. I've like totally slipped my mind that Shroud was posting three things at once, so now I'm like just commenting on everything. Oh my gosh, if only you guys knew how like fast my heart was racing right now. There's gonna be so much dead time in this vlog that I need to cut out just because I keep like going from screaming and chatting to like hyper focusing. <laughs> I'm shaking, oh my goodness. I should have eaten lunch before this because now my like heart is racing too much and my belly is too full of butterflies to even think about eating. That is fine, I'm freaking out. I literally like, it's blowing my mind right now. Like I have a second collab with Shroud and it's been revealed and that's just nuts. Actually, it will have already launched by the time this vlog goes up too because it's going up a couple days after the launch. Oh my gosh, I'm just freaking out. So you're gonna see another freak out in <laughs> a later part of this vlog, probably. Okay, I'm gonna go take a moment to try to calm down and start responding to comments and things like that. I just wanted to share this moment with you, especially because I'm just alone right now. So <laughs> just thank you again, like for the love and support. Like, I just can't believe it. I am just flabbergasted right now. Okay, I'm actually having another moment. I just need to talk it out. So like when we did the teaser like a week before today, like 
a lot of you knew, right? Because we did like Hello Friends and it was clearly like there were bats on the black and white packaging and it was spooky names, similar layout. So like a lot of people assumed, right? But this is the first time people are seeing like my color story. And I know that's obvious and that's like, duh. <laughs> but it's just blowing my mind because obviously people were getting excited a week ago and that felt good. But now people are freaking out over the color story and I'm just so excited. You have no idea, especially when we came out with the Bats palette, like I knew I loved my color story, but there's no way to know like if everyone's gonna love my color story. And literally not everyone loves every color story, obviously, but just the amount of love it received blew my mind. And seeing how much you, oh, hi, Kanade. Oh, goodness. <laughs> seeing how excited everyone is so far over this one already is just making my heart so happy. I've just been sitting on the floor here for 15 minutes, just refreshing and responding to comments. And my heart is just so full. So just thank you again. Thank you again. I think I'm done for now. Maybe I'll take you along for dinner or maybe I'll just spend time with my family, but I'll catch you next time I want to pick up the camera. Hi friends. It's a couple days later. I've just been working a lot and also just absorbing all the love on the reveal. It's been so exciting. Just thank you again for your support. I know I've already said that a hundred times, but I'm gonna say it a hundred more. It's just so exciting and my heart is so full and just thank you. But yeah, I just got done filming this little look. I used just the Bats palette. Wanted to give her a little individual love this week as well since the restock is also happening on the 6th, which again, will have already happened by the time this vlog goes up. Oh, and just a reminder, if things did sell out, there will be a restock Coming. We're hoping end of September or early October, just kind of whenever that gets squared away. But yeah, I am going to just probably edit this little Instagram video that I filmed and then head off to work soon. And I think tonight, I feel like I want to look at Target again. I want to see if our Target has gained any Halloween because the shelves were clear last time we went about a week, week and a half ago. So maybe things have progressed. I don't have my hopes set very high, but yeah, I think we might check tonight, just depending on if I'm exhausted after work, but I don't work tomorrow, so maybe we'll go after I get off work tonight. And tomorrow's gonna be so fun because we're going to Disney for the Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween party. We do this every single year, although last year was definitely more of a bust. They raised the prices astronomically compared to previous years, and then they took away a bunch of things. It was called like the Boo Bash or something, and it was definitely not as good. There were way less activities, like there wasn't a Hocus Pocus show, there wasn't the big parade, it was just a couple mini like floats that would go by every like 20 minutes or so. Uh, less trick or treat stations, just things like that. It wasn't as big, and I definitely said, if it stays like that forever, I don't really wanna go back because it was just not really worth it. And the time frame to be there was way less. So like it was more money for less time, but they brought back the original time. They brought back all the original things. It's still a little bit of a higher price, but I will pay it if I can do all the fun things that I used to do. So I'm really excited. The Halloween event itself is from like seven to midnight, but you can get in as early as four. So you better believe I will be at the gates at like 3.55 <laughs> so that we can be there right away, especially because we don't always last till midnight. We're old people. I like to be asleep no later than like 10, 30, 11 on like a spicy night. So the fact that we're gonna be up till potentially 11 or even 11.30 and then driving back home, yeah. <laughs> gonna need to drink some coffee. Uh, but yeah, I'm really excited. I will definitely take you along for Disney. It's gonna be so fun and I just cannot wait. How hopeful are you, Zane? <laughs> Honestly, I think there's a 20% chance. That's it. <laughs> I see jack o lanterns Look at... <laughs> That's cute. They're so cute. See, these ones are blue. The cats are gonna be so happy. We love when the Targets have new cat scratchers. There's two new ones. You got the claw counts and the skeleton part. Yeah, it's so cute. Lots of pumpkins and him. There's no decor, but we got candy. You better believe I will eat Halloween candy for a bellyache. Got the goods. <laughs> All the pumpkins and snacks and things. <laughs> Not me buying a bunch of Halloween candy when we're literally gonna get a bunch of free Halloween candy at Disney tomorrow. Yep. Also, I try really hard not to eat dairy that much anymore. I've talked about that a few times, but there are certain things I will risk having a bellyache for. How much dairy is in white chocolate? Huh? Going down. <laughs> Going down. I don't know. It just said milk. So, I mean, there's more milk in white chocolate. I just didn't, never thought about it. Than in like dark chocolate. 
But yeah, that was good. That hit the spot. Would you like one? Um, in a minute. I'll open it for you. I'm about to stop. What is, <clears throat> what is your favorite? White chocolate always makes me cough. <laughs> I think that's a thing. Like I've heard other people say that. <laughs> what is your favorite kind of chocolate, everyone? I like dark chocolate. I love dark chocolate, but I get down with all the chocolates. What do you like the best? Do you like white chocolate the best? Um, I do like white chocolate a lot. I wouldn't say it's the best though. There's so much McDonald's litter in the middle of the road. Yeah. Like, did someone just like scarf down all of their McDoubles and just, and just it out the eat it out the and window? All, all over the place. Humans. But we're gonna go grab dinner and then head home. And tomorrow we're going to Disney. And we're gonna listen to Disney music the whole way there. Are you excited? I'm so excited. <laughs> Disney day! I just got done filming this little look with both of my palettes, which will already be up on Instagram and TikTok by the time this video goes up. Um, I just did not even bother curling my hair today like I usually do because it's probably gonna rain all day. A Little bit of a bummer, but not the end of the world. We have umbrellas. We're not gonna melt. Um, I will show you my outfit though, cause it's very cute. I just wanted to go with stripes. This is the bag I got at the vampire gift shop in New Orleans. These pants are from Too Fast Clothing. And then I just have my platform converse. And we're gonna go soon. Leela, are you jealous that you're not going? You wouldn't wanna go, you'd be so scared. Hi babies, what's going on? Are you excited for Disney? Yeah. You got your Halloween shirt on? Yeah. Cute. I'm excited. Me too. I'm not gonna bring this camera though if it's gonna rain all day. So we get phone quality phone. from here all out. Phone quality <laughs> here all out, I don't know how to talk. I'm too excited. Here all out. Here on <laughs> out. <laughs> Is this haunted room actually stretching, or is it your imagination? Mm -hmm. If we ride the haunted mansion, if we didn't get stopped at a standstill, yeah. nope. <laughs> we stuck. The rain has subsided finally. Yeah. But there's a big plus of it raining is all the normies <laughs> who don't live in Florida flee when it rains. So we've been on so many rides already with like zero weights. It's been wonderful. Yeah. And the party itself starts like any minute now. And then we'll get to go trick or treating and see the Hocus Pocus show and the parade and all the fun things. 10 minutes. <laughs> the flares were not my finest moment though. I call them my puddle pants now. <laughs> fun fact, I hate the country bears more than anything else <laughs> on the planet. The hold that the smell of the Pirates of the Caribbean ride has on me. If you know, you know, this ride just has such a good smell. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it. You just gotta breathe it in and enjoy. <laughs> Monster cookie ice cream sandwich. It's huge. I don't it's, know how to bite this. It's very large. Go for it. <laughs> good? Mm -hmm. Disney ducks. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> Got more snacks. All right. This is the apple pie milkshake. Take a sip. Literally tastes like apple pie. Like, <laughs> Let me try this one this now. This is the candy corn soft serve. Well, it's sweet corn. Sweet I guess corn. that's the same thing. It actually tastes really good. Nice. It's kind of mild. Now I get to try. All right. You want it? You got it? <laughs> Nice. <laughs> How's the donut hole? Mm. Take a sip of that and tell me that it doesn't taste exactly like apple pie. What did the donut taste like? Just good? <laughs> like a cinnamon roll donut hole. Oh, cool. Doesn't it taste exactly like apple pie and ice cream? Oh yeah, that's good. It's so good. And then that, I don't know how to describe it. It just tastes sweet, but like mild at the same time. Yeah, that's good. It's melting. <laughs> Eat it fast. It's falling over. You can't stop the things I love. I love. Got the goods. A little Nightmare Before Christmas jack-o'-lantern. The parade got canceled since it was lightning, yeah. but not raining. Um, and the next one wasn't for two hours and we already rode everything and we already trick-or-treated and yeah. we were worried we'd wait two hours and then the weather would still be bad. So we decided just to shop instead. Yep. And now we're gonna go on the ferry 
and head home. We're almost at the car now and almost it's already there. started raining again and it's supposed to rain harder for the next hour or more There's and the parade fireworks. starts in like 45 minutes so yeah. we very right likely call. that it probably would have gotten canceled so I'm happy to be going to the car. We've seen the parade a lot. It's a bummer to not see it but it's fine. I mean, Today it was still got, really fun. It been canceled so yeah. It is what it is. We had a good time. I have lipstick on my chin I think. <laughs> no I don't. I think it's just the lighting. <laughs> oh, I'm so ready to sleep. Girl what are you doing in the window? Oh Halloween cat stretch. <laughs> You look so cozy up there. You going down now? Bye, Edelyn. <laughs> Hi, friends. It's the next day. Yesterday was just so fun. And we were thinking about how, like, the parades got rained out, right? And we realized we think it's karma for somebody else because we were waiting, like, in the general area to watch the Hocus Pocus show and then the parade right after for... I don't know, 30 minutes or so. And we had a pretty good spot. And then this one family kind of just like took over and this one lady literally pushed me out of the way, like visibly like shoved me back. Um, so we think that it got canceled at the last minute for her karma because I can live without the parade, <laughs> but she was so upset, like angry, angry about it, which it does suck for it to get canceled, but I think it was her karma. That's what I'm telling myself at least. But it was so fun. I'm glad we got to go and just enjoy some Halloween festivities. I, it was just so fun. I got this hat. My friend Trisha sent me a few hats from Witchwood Bags that she wasn't using anymore. And I am already so happy. Also Kaleidos just sent me their new collection. So I just filmed a little video with it. I think this will be up. I think after this vlog goes up, let me check my upload schedule for you. Yes, I think it's going up the day after this vlog goes up. So just stay tuned. It's a really fun collection and I'm excited to play with it some more. And I think I'm actually gonna end the vlog here. Like this vlog isn't even going up for another like five days or so, but we have some fun things we're doing tomorrow. And I think I'd rather save that for the next vlog or else next vlog might be kind of boring. And there's already a lot going on in this one. So I think this seems like a good place to end it. And now I can just, leisurely edit this video over the next few days <laughs> but thank you so much for hanging out hi edelin my goodness hi baby you want to be part of us again <laughs> her tail going nuts <laughs> but just thank you so much as always i love hanging out with you thank you so much for the love on my collab edelin says thank you also thanks for hanging out while we went to disney it was a really fun week and i'm just happy that i shared it with you right baby girl if you made it to the end of this vlog, why don't you leave some Halloween related emojis and if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It helps my channel out a lot and if you're not already, you can follow me on my other socials. You can join the Batty Bean fam. I am Batty Bean on everything, Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter. Edelin is sniffing the viewfinder. <laughs> and if you want, you can subscribe if you want to see more of my videos. I'm posting most days over here. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. You want to say K-bye? K-bye, Edelin!